Morgan here. So today I'm going to be talking about 10 skills that we can learn at home. There's so much that we can learn at our house, at home, where we don't even have to leave or, you know, leave our general property. So let's dive right in and I would love to hear your comments. And also if you really like my videos and my content, please head to the links down below to my description, my Patreon. Um, I have online courses at my website and my website has lots of great blogs and newsletter and all that good stuff. So head on down there. Okay, so let's dive right in. The first one's gonna be gardening. Um, even if you live in an apartment, a, a, a container garden is gonna be really good. And if you can't have an, a, a container garden, at least get some kind of little herb garden or something. Some type of little garden um, is gonna be really really useful to you right now and you got lots of time plus it's spring so this is like the perfect time to start a garden all right the next one's going to be dry firing techniques or any sort of self-defense techniques in general so practice your self-defense practice your dry firing um, any any anything like that you could can be done at home uh, and you don't need to go anywhere if you do have property and you can uh, you know fire off a few live rounds definitely uh, do that. It's a great time to do that right now. All right, the next one's going to be exercising. You don't need a gym for exercising. In fact, I'm going to have a video coming up this week or next, in the next few days or so, uh, that's talking all about at-home exercising, using just what you have available to you. You don't even need to go out and buy any special equipment. So I'm going to be doing an exercise video on that. But in the meantime, just get up and walk around your house. Throw your buck out bag on and just walk around. So many great opportunities, especially if you're just kind of watching TV or YouTube. Get up and walk and jog or play in place or something like that. Anyway, I'll have way more um, examples and uh, ideas in the exercise video. The next one is going to be cooking. Cooking is absolutely a skill, especially when it comes to cooking with our food storage. It's really important to know how to cook with it, um, you know, how to make it tasty, especially if you're just working with beans and rice, right? What kind of spices and things you're going to cook with? Um, so learning how to cook in general, but also learning how to cook with your food storage is absolutely a skill. And get the kids involved too, it'll be a lot of fun. All right, the next skill is going to be basically any DIY. So make your own soap, make your own candles, um, make a little rocket stove. I mean, there's so many great DIY projects. I actually have a whole list on my website. I just go down to growpreparedness.com and search DIY in the search bar and you'll see a bunch of great projects. Or you can search here on YouTube for uh, some great DIY projects. All right, the next one's gonna be practicing shelter techniques, like practicing um, a tarp shelter technique, setting up your tent in the living room to have like a fun little, you know, inside camping, or even setting up the tent if you, if you have a backyard. Uh, setting up the tent outside, having a little fun outside. Practice your shelter techniques out in your backyard, inside your living room, whatever. All right, the next one's gonna be practicing sewing. <laughs> uh, practice sewing techniques. Um, you know, when things rip or, you know, if you need to make clothes, sewing is a great skill. And sewing by hand specifically is something that you should really be practicing. Um, like me in, in particular, we don't have a sewing machine, so I really have to practice a lot more by sewing by hand. You know, so sewing anything um, is a great skill to know. All right, the next skill is going to be repairing stuff. So um, repairing cars, bikes, and repairing things in your home. Get on YouTube, get some books, whatever you have to do to learn how to repair things yourself. Of course, I don't expect you to learn how to repair everything yourself, right? There may be some little niche specific things that maybe you want to hire a professional for, but it may, would be nice to know, you know, how to fix little things, how to change your own oil, how to change a tire, how to, um, you know, do your own bike maintenance, how to fix little things around the house. It's just truly empowering and it is truly a skill that we should all know. Uh, simple repairs. The next one that I think is a skill, but of course I think could be debated, is uh, knowing how to reuse things. I think um, our society in general is pretty wasteful and so, you know, when you, <laughs> husband and I always look at stuff, like he just had a uh, belt that broke the other day and he's like, how can we reuse this? And I'm like, I don't know, I'll figure out a way. <laughs> you know, in this day and age especially, you know, we always want to try to find ways to reuse things. Even if we have to cut it up, you know, to make it into smaller pieces to use it for something else, you know, there's always, there's usually always ways to reuse at least a small part of something uh, for something else. 
All right, the next one is going to be looking at your finances, creating a serious budget and sticking to budgets and uh, learning how to save money and save uh, and make more money. So this is definitely a skill and one that not everyone has. You know, um, a lot of people live paycheck to paycheck and I understand that, and especially, you know, um, during right now at the time of making this video, there's, um, you know, the pandemic going on and a lot of people are losing their jobs and realizing that they don't have enough to, to, to sustain them until, you know, things return to normal, whenever that happens to be. So, um, f knowing our finances and creating a budget and all that is, is a skill, I think. All right, and as a bonus, um, knowledge. I think learning knowledge through books, YouTube, um, ha online courses, however you decide to learn your knowledge is definitely a skill and skill that we should be practicing um, on a regular basis. I think if this pandemic has taught, taught us anything, it's that knowledge and skills will be highly sought over over gear, right? So we can um, create a lot out of nothing, but we need the knowledge in order to create that whatever out of nothing, right? So um, learning all the skills and learning all the techniques is definitely something we really want to prioritize, especially when we have the extra time to do so. All right, and a double bonus is going to be teaching kids. Teach your kids everything, involve them in everything. Teaching in general, I think is, is definitely a skill. <laughs> Teaching kids how to do everything that you're doing, involving them in your life, involve them in the gardening, involve them in the sewing, involve them in everything. And you'll be really surprised how quickly they learn and how excited they get to learn these things. Even if they're not doing it perfect at first, be patient with them, teach them, and show them the ways. <laughs> All right. That's it for this video. I would love to hear your ideas on skills that you can learn at home. Don't forget to uh, visit my website and my Patreon. Links down below in the description. Thank you all so much for watching. Conquer tomorrow by preparing today. Stay well. Talk to y'all tomorrow. Bye.